Khalifa. Oh my god, enough with the fat around the organs. That is not a real thing. It is made up. Maybe you should keep the comments to yourself until you actually know what you're talking about. That last statement was fairly bold. Because fat around the organs is not made up. Fat around the organs is referred to as visceral fat. And a simple DEXA scan can show you all of the visceral fat that lines your organs. Visceral fat is not only very easy to see, but there are many risk factors associated with it. Visceral fat is associated with an increase in metabolic syndrome, cardiovascular disease, and many different cancers. And visceral fat is associated with a decline in insulin sensitivity, which is why visceral fat is very strongly correlated with something like type 2 diabetes. In regards to visceral fat, it does appear that everyone has what is referred to as their personal fat threshold. As we begin to store body fat, it is in the form of subcutaneous fat, which is the soft fat around our thighs, buttocks, and the portion of our stomach that is very close to the skin. And this type of fat is actually thought to be protective. And it's a way of storing energy when we need it for the future. However, there does appear to be a threshold by which additional weight gain leads to visceral fat accumulation. And unfortunately, this threshold is different across different populations. It does appear that Chinese and South Asian individuals are more likely to develop visceral fat than someone that is European. To put this simply at the same body fat percentage, individuals of Chinese or South Asian descent are likely going to have a higher percentage of visceral fat compared to subcutaneous fat, where it appears that Caucasians are able to get a little bit larger before they begin to develop very high levels of visceral fat. But luckily, it's very well documented that exercise and weight loss drastically decreases visceral fat and all of the adverse complications that come along with high levels of visceral fat. And if you want to learn how to take control of your health and energy, send me a DM to sign up for coaching.